Excellencies, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, greetings. I thank the Chinese Academy of Sciences for the invitation to address the 2022 International Development Forum on Big Data for Sustainable Development Goals. Technology and innovation are important tools to support the achievement of the Sustainable Development Goals. Big Data is an ever-pervasive trend in digital technology permeating many aspects of our work and its power when harnessed responsibility can accelerate the implementation of the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development. The power of data has potential implications for nearly all aspects of the United Nations work on peace and security, human rights, sustainable development and climate action as well as humanitarian aid. However, seven years after the adaption of the 2030 Agenda, many countries, particularly the least developed countries, still rely on outdated and incomplete data to inform implementation. Millions of people globally are not covered by existing data sources and are therefore excluded from decision-making and policies. The lack of timely and High quality data is still holding back progress in the measurement and achievement of the Sustainable Development Goals, especially in the face of our interlinked global challenges, including the COVID-19 pandemic, climate change, increasing conflict, growing poverty and hunger, rising inequalities. Here, ladies and gentlemen, lies the urgency to harness the power of big data to address these crises better and accelerate global progress towards achieving the SDGs. While digital technology has enormous potential for positive change but can also reinforce disparities and deepen divides. Without proper governance, the potentially harmful aspects of big data and digital technology will have negative real-world consequences in people's lives. However, Effective data governance can lead to a better data analytics, resulting in better decision-making by policymakers and thus improved outcomes. The United Nations Secretary General's Roadmap for Digital Cooperation lays out a roadmap in which all stakeholders play a role in advancing a safer, more equitable digital world, one which will lead to a brighter and more prosperous future for all. As the United Nations Secretary General, Mr. Antonio Guterres, has said, and I quote, we have a collective responsibility to give direction to those technology that we can maximize benefits and curtail unintended consequences and malicious use, end of quote. Data has become a key strategic asset for creating both private and social value. Effective policies become nearly impossible without high quality data, providing the right information on the right things at the right time. Data is multidimensional and its uses as implications beyond just trade and economic development. I commend and congratulate the Chinese Academy of Sciences for its work in hosting the International Research Center of Big Data for Sustainable Development Goals or CBAS. During his address at the 75th session of the United Nations General Assembly, President Xi Jinping first announced that China would set up CBAS. Since its inauguration last September, we have seen CBAS aim to harness big data for sustainable development goals to address many challenges found here in China and around the world. This is most welcome. Ladies and gentlemen, Today's forum is another opportunity to bring big data communities together, showcase solutions, nurture partnerships to make big data for all a reality. It is time for us to unite the public and private sectors, policymakers, academia and civil society to explore ways to harness the power of big data for sustainable development and humanitarian action. Going forward, we need to invest in data and digital technology to get ahead of the crisis so that we can trigger more timely responses, anticipate future needs and map out the steps needed to implement the 2030 Agenda to achieve the Sustainable Development Goals. I wish you all very, very productive deliberations today. Thank you very much. Xie Xie.